So one of the headaches about um, running an EC2 instance if you are new to the AWS console is being able to view your web server after you have um, attached it or deployed it from an EC2 instance. So I've got an instance here uh, from one of the labs that I got from AWS. So if I go into that instance, I've got, I do have a public IP, IP, IPv4 address and I'm going to open it to see if my web server is visible on the internet. I've already downloaded it. I've already created uh, my web server, coded it. And then now I uploaded it to EC2 instance and I want to see if it's available on the internet. So you see now it's, ta and it's taking a little bit longer to load. Then it says that this site can't be reached. So what seems to be the problem? Because now my IPv4, my IPv4 address is right there. I've got uh, an elastic IP address, which I've already enabled. And I've enabled also an IAM, IAM role. Then I decided, okay, cool, maybe there might be security. Maybe I, I did not uh, allow traffic from the internet to access my web server. I go to security and now I need to view my security rules to see if I've allowed internet from the traffic uh, to view contents on my web server. So I'm going to edit inbound rules and kind of see what I have. I do have HTTP, that is, it says that um, I can allow traffic from the internet, which is 0 .0 .0 0.0.0.0. .0 .0. So everything is fine here. There's nothing wrong there. So then what seems to be the problem? So now I'm going to go back. Let me just leave the security group and go back to my instance again. Uh, where's my instance? I go back to my instance again. So my security groups have allowed um, traffic from the internet. I do have a, uh, I do have my ECT instance in a public subnet. I'll just show you just now. I got a public IPv4 address. Uh, there is my public uh, subnet. My EC2 is in a public subnet. And I've got an elastic IP address. So you know what the problem is? If you go here, just double click that, you see it says HTTPS. I don't have any rules on my security group that cater for HTTPS. So if I remove the S and press enter, there we go. It actually uploads my, my web server. So you're doing good, Mohaver at so follow me, follow me for more guys. I am an AWS cloud uh, expert, solutions architect to be precise. I'll see you soon.